yo what's going on you guys welcome back to my channel so today i decided to do a little mukbang with you guys we are eating the spicy noodles but this is cheese flavor i've never ever ever tried these so i'm pretty excited hopefully they are actually cheesy like it still comes with the spicy sauce but it has cheese powder to add to it i do have the little sauce right here in case i need to add more but i only added like half of the packet because y'all know that is spicy like if you go way back i actually did the two times spicy noodle challenge and y'all i was dying i was freaking dying so i'm like you know what let me get the cheese flavor I've never tried it, so I'm like, oh, why not? And I also got this Korean, I'm guessing this is like sparkling water. I'm not 100% sure, but I think that's what it is. I mean, it's not even in English, guys, so I can't even like read it. Like everything on the back is in Korean, like literally. Like can someone translate? <laughs> but um one thing it does say is it says fresh flavor and zero sweeteners and that's the only english words i see and then clop clop cap well the brand is called clop and it's actually um what is this called like sealable like you're able to oh that's cold you're able to seal the can again let's go ahead and open it how do you open it does it have instructions? It actually has pictured instructions. Okay, thank you for that. So, you pull this out. Wait a second. Oh my god, I can't even hold it because it's so cold. Hold on, let me look at that picture. Okay, so, you lift this okay let me just show you guys what it looks like because clearly we don't have that here so or at least american drinks we don't have these type of tapas oh my goodness someone with long nails would not be able to open this am i doing this right <gasps> oh my god Did that happen because it's frozen or because I just fucked up by opening it like that? <laughs> Yo, I'm scared now. Okay, you lift it. You pull it. Okay, and then you pull it and you sip it here in the front. <laughs> that is too advanced for us Americans here. <laughs> Let's try it though. Mmm. That is definitely sparkling water. That's good. So at the store, I did see a bubble tea. And I'm like, ooh, let me get that. But actually, that's from Taiwan. And you know, I'm doing a whole Korean thing here. So this is actually Korean. I did look this up. Look at that. So then you just push it. And it's closed again. Should we test it out? See if it spills? We have to. Oh snap, it actually works, guys. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I don't know why I'm like so amazed. Chill out, Drea. Ch oh shit. Why does it pop every time I do that though? Sheesh. Probably looks sweaty now. I like that. We approve. We approve. So let's go ahead and try these noodles out. Um, I also have cucumbers and spicy what is that called radishes so let's mix that together so the radishes did come in a little packet but they weren't that saucy and 
so yeah, I went ahead and added the cucumber. I added some soy sauce. I added some yum yum sauce. I added some Tabasco sriracha, some garlic powder, and yeah, I added hella stuff. So let's hope it's good. I mean, it looks pretty good. Oh my god, so I'm excited to try this. Oh my god, please do not burn my insides. Oh my god, this looks so good though. I love me some noodles. Cheers, guys. Oh, yeah. It has just the right of spice in it. Not too spicy. spicy I'm definitely not gonna need extra sauce on there <sighs> yeah oh and I added um a little bit of cheddar like shredded cheddar cheese on top also but just like very lightly <sighs> they taste really good but of course they are spicy either way like a noodle stuck right there in my throat <clears throat> yo <clears throat> oh my god if I start choking right now I have no one to save me right now God, I'm not even kidding guys I don't know if y'all can hear it in my voice that's just <coughs> I don't know if to bring it up or down about that oh my god I feel so much better <clears throat> literally a piece of noodle just hanging out in my throat okay let's try some radishes now Lupe Lupe this girlfriend I dropped my camera <laughs> by the way I just got a cat I don't know if I ever like told you guys I know y'all saw it in the background of my past videos but I got a kitty now and I named her Lupe like Guadalupe so I can call her Guadalupe or Lupita <laughs> mm. yeah you look cute right there They're definitely not spicy though. I don't know why the bag said spicy. 
I got a good idea. How about we add a little bit? Okay, just a little bit though, cause just so I can get some type of spice in there. Oh my God. And of course I went to an Asian store to buy this and I saw sriracha. It was $8, but I'm like, do I want to buy it or not? I mean, honestly, I kind of regret not buying it because y'all know right now we have a sriracha shortage. So yeah, you are not going to find it in no restaurants, nothing like that. It tastes a lot better. <clears throat> but yeah, they had sriracha. <clears throat> and they literally had a sign there that limit to only one. <laughs> made two of these goddamn <laughs> I got a whole pack right here and I've heard there was a habanero one but that one wasn't there and I actually wanted to try that one but Guys, as I was getting ready, I was listening to um, this podcast of um, Lexi Treviso. I know you guys have heard of that case. I want to know your guys' thought. Well, for those that don't know about the case, it's about a girl, a 19-year-old girl in new mexico that basically had a baby threw it in the trash of the hospital like she gave birth in the hospital in the bathroom didn't tell anybody and throw threw her baby in the trash can and then just left it there So obviously now they're charging her with murder, with tampering with evidence. She got arrested and she bailed out. Basically, she threw her baby. She said the whole time though, she denied having sex. Like the mom had no idea she was pregnant. The girl, Lexi, had no idea she was pregnant. Like really? I saw pictures of her and it's literally a skinny girl. A skinny girl with a big old belly. Come on now. But what's weird is that she stopped taking birth control and started taking weight loss <clears throat> pills. So why would you do that if you're obviously having sex with your boyfriend and don't want to get pregnant or are being careful? Like why would you get off your birth control and start taking weight loss? Like I feel like she was just trying to hide her belly as much as much as she can because she did she was in a relationship for like two years with this guy and then apparently he didn't know she was pregnant either that she would only complain about her back hurting and that's really the main reason why she even went to the hospital Like, I don't even believe that the mom didn't know. I feel like she knew, deep down she knew, but since the daughter always, ooh, let me wipe my lips because that starts burning if you leave that sauce on your lips. But yeah, I feel like the mom knew she was pregnant but was in denial and was just letting her daughter 
keep saying, oh no, I'm not pregnant, I'm just getting fed, or whatever the case was. And I'm sure the mom was like, oh, okay, well, it better be that because if you're pregnant, blah, 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 you know, you'll be in trouble. Because apparently Lexi was terrified of her mom. So, yeah. How are you going to be in the hospital after you delivered a baby and still say you're a virgin? You've never had sex. Come on now. And then when they went inside the room... To tell her they found a baby in the trash can, Lexi right away was like, oh, it wasn't breathing, like, it wasn't doing anything, you know, it didn't cry. The mom was like, Lexi, like, I told you about this, I just asked you. So you knew. You knew. Mm -mm. And now the defense team is trying to make a case against the hospital. That it was the hospital's fault. Something about, um, what's that called? Wrongful death or something like that? That girl knew she was pregnant when she got to the hospital. There's just no way. And you know what? Let's say the girl didn't know. I know the mom knew. There's no way. You're skinny, girl. Her arms are skinny. Her belly skinny. Her legs are skinny. She's a skinny girl. And out of nowhere, you have this big ass belly. Come on now. Like, make it make sense here. Lupe! Lupe! Get off my camera. Get off my camera, goddamn. Yeah, guys, let me know what you guys think about that case. Because that's just crazy. And it's so sad for the nurses and the doctors that had to go through that. And now there's a case against them. Like, they did something wrong. Like... Mm -mm. I'm so mad I'm eating faster now. <laughs> Thank you guys so much for joining me. Make sure you guys follow me on my Instagram and on my TikTok. And go ahead and subscribe if you haven't already. Like, we're homies here. We're friends. Like, let me know what you guys want to see and I will give it to you guys. Give your girl a big thumbs up. Leave a comment down below. And I'll catch you guys next time. Bye.